The evolution from Web 2 to Web 3 represents a fundamental shift in the internet structure and ethos. In the centralized landscape of Web 2, tech giants and platforms exerted control over user data and content, raising privacy and censorship concerns. However, Web 3, powered by blockchain technology, offers a decentralized user-centric vision. Users gain control over their data through self-sovereign identity, reducing reliance on intermediaries and enhancing privacy. NFTs introduce digital scarcity, empowering unique ownership of digital assets. DeFi protocols provide an alternative to traditional finance, offering permissionless access to financial services. Open governance through DAOs ensures community-driven decision-making. As Web3 gains momentum, it promises a more inclusive, secure, and equitable internet, fostering innovation and creativity in a decentralized and transparent ecosystem. In this video, we will investigate one of the projects that engaged in the development of a decentralized alternative internet network to be used as the infrastructure platform for Web3. I'm George from KK Technologies. In this video, I'm going to take you on an exciting journey into the world of Tominant, also known as Tommy. It's a groundbreaking project that aims to create a new and improved internet, one that is truly decentralized, free from censorship, and designed to protect your privacy and freedom. To understand Tominant, we need to start with some background on the current internet, also known as the World Wide Web, WWW. The WWW was intended to be an open and free platform where people could freely express themselves and access information from anywhere in the world. However, over time, it has fallen under the control of centralized entities, such as corporations and governments, leading to censorship and restrictions on internet access. One of the most well-known cases of internet censorship is in China, where the government blocks access to certain websites to control information flow. But this is not limited to China. Many other countries, including Indonesia, have imposed strict regulations on technology companies, leading to website shutdowns and limited access to information. The centralized control of the web has put businesses at risk and has also led to the deterioration of citizens' lifestyles as they depend on these businesses for various services and information. Enter Tominate, the solution to these problems. It is part of the Web3 movement, which started with the creation of Bitcoin, aiming to provide a decentralized monetary system. However, Web3's full potential has not been realized yet due to its reliance on existing internet infrastructure and some centralized protocols. Tominate's goal is to take the best features of Web2 technology and add encryption, self-sovereign identity, Web3 tokenomics and governance to build a truly decentralized internet. Let's explore some of the key elements of Tominate. TDNS, Tommy Domain Name System. This is Tominate's alternative to the traditional DNS system, which is currently controlled by centralized authorities like ICANN. TDNS is governed by a decentralized autonomous organization, DAO, which means that decisions about domain names are made by the community instead of a small group of centralized entities. This eliminates the possibility of censorship and allows for true ownership of domain names. Tomadu. This is the heart of Tominate's governance. It is a DAO that allows anyone in the network to participate in decision-making. Members of the Tomadu can propose and vote on various policies, such as blocking websites that violate community guidelines. This system ensures that decisions are made by the people, for the people, protecting against capture and corruption. Privacy and encryption. Tominate prioritizes privacy, allowing people to surf the web with full anonymity if they choose to. It also incorporates zero-knowledge proof technologies to protect voters' identities during decision-making processes in the Tomadu. Token economy. Tominate uses its native TOMI tokens to incentivize and reward contributors to the network. TOMI tokens play a crucial role in the governance of Tominate and provide economic incentives for participants to maintain and develop the network. Today, Non-extractive business models. Unlike traditional internet platforms that rely on advertising and exploiting users' data, 
Cominant aims to create new business models that are not dependent on such practices. NFTs, non-fungible tokens, are used to represent ownership of websites, data, identity, and voting rights, creating new possibilities for economic activities. And boarding pioneers, early contributors to Tominant are recognized as pioneers, gaining unique governance rights and influence over the network's development. Pioneers have the ability to propose and vote on issues in the Tomadu, making them integral to shaping the future of Tominant. In conclusion, Tominant is a revolutionary project that seeks to reclaim the true essence of the Internet by creating a decentralized, censorship-resistant and privacy-focused web. By leveraging the best of Web 2 and Web 3 technologies, Tominant offers a promising alternative to the current centralized Internet, empowering users and protecting their rights to freedom and liberty. Cryptocurrencies are highly volatile, so your cash can go down as well as up in the blink of an eye. As always, you should never invest in something you don't understand. What are your thoughts about the Tominant, Tommy? Would you use or invest in it?